Beach here in South Philadelphia. Thanks for having us in to kick off a new year. Mike Tirico, Greg Olson, Greg, you looked this as a player. It's so exciting for us as fans, but now after that long off season to get your body ready and your team ready and your game ready, finally show everybody what it's all about. Week one of the season has arrived. Yeah, and at this stage in the process, Mike, you're exactly right. All you want is for this ball to be kicked off. You're tired of practicing. You're tired of the off-season workouts. You're tired of the preparation for what feels like it is... So, what lies in store for these teams this season? The talking's done, we're about to find out. It's week one, and off we go on EA Sports. Nice job by the return team as he takes it across the 30-yard line. So the Philadelphia offense set to take over for the first time. They'll be led out by a young man who's making a name for himself, their rookie quarterback. This is the moment, Mike. He's been working towards this day ever since hearing his name called on draft night, and he's put the work in over the last few months. This franchise clearly feels that he's ready to go. But what did he say to us through the day, Mike? He said, I don't have to admit, it's going to be surreal walking out on that field to take my first snap as a starting NFL quarterback. And I think once he settles in and gets rid of any early nerves, he's confident that he'll show everybody that he belongs. On play action, he'll set up to throw. That's complete to the rookie first-round pick. And he's taken down inside the opponent's 35. Rough start to this drive for the defense. Back-to-back -back big plays. This one for 27 yards. They've done a nice job spreading the ball around. Make the defense have to account for as many different weapons as possible here early. I think back to our conversation with this coaching staff, Mike. They identified this guy as someone they needed to get involved early and often, so that might be his first target, but I don't think it's going to be his last. And the defense all over this one. They knock him down, it'll go down as a loss of two. Here's a second and 12. At the 34 yard line. They'll look to throw. That's complete to his big tight end, Dallas Goddard. These are the play calls, Mike, that offensive coordinators use to just get their quarterback and their passing game into some sort of rhythm. Easy pitch and catch, get the ball out of his hand, see a completion. These typically, as the game goes on, lead to bigger and bigger gains. It picks up 25 yards and gives them a golden opportunity. It's first and goal. Now they'll set up to throw. He's got his big tight end. Touchdown, Eagles. And that's a football to hold on to forever. His first NFL touchdown in his very first NFL game. Exactly the way they scripted this one. A beautiful opening drive, Greg. Able to find the end zone on the game's first possession. And Mike, the word that comes to mind looking at that drive is execution. And that's exactly what they talked about all week long. They wanted to come out early in this game and establish an early rhythm. And that's exactly what they did with that touchdown drive. Seven nothing is our score as this kick is sent into the air. He fields it at the eight. And they'll bring him down just shy of the 30-yard line. The Washington offense is going to make their way to the field for the first time. They are led by the former Heisman Trophy winner out of LSU, Jaden Daniels. There's just something special about week one, isn't it, Mike? I mean, after months of anticipation, speculation, it finally hits you, the season has arrived. This is the first time where we're going to get to see a lot of the debuts of players on new teams, new coaches, rookies taking the field for the very first time in a meaningful game. The preseason is one thing, but it's an entirely different level of excitement once opening weekend rolls around. I don't know about you, but I'm excited to see what's in store for us that these games finally now matter. That's caught. Safe 
Saquon Barkley. And that's a first down. It will be a gain of eight. So you come back out here after watching the opposing team score first, and what you want to do is you got to establish a little early rhythm and get the drive started. Every offensive coordinator has drive starters, meaning it's a completion. It's a run play that we feel great about. It's a screen. Get a little positive energy into that huddle, and what hopefully starts out good ends with you being able to get some points of your own. Off the play fake, here's Daniels. He'll get that to his tight end, Ben Sinnott. And nice work after the catch. He stopped a little short of the first down marker, but it is a pickup of nine. Third in a yard, it's Daniel. This one is caught by Dotson. And it looks like he's going to have a first down. Nothing fancy there. Short completion, but it yields a fresh set of downs. Operating from the gun, it's Daniels. Right side, catch made by McLaurin. First catch for him on this new season, and it results in a first down. So, first quarter in the books here on NFL Kickoff Weekend. 7-0 is our score. And we're back in Philly in a moment. Here's first and ten. Daniel gonna throw again. That's gonna be intercepted. He works free. Great shot. Well, it just tried a very short throw, and instead. The defense takes it back the other way, and they come up with a big play, scoring the touchdown. Mike, for how fast he jumped that route, it almost seems like he was in the huddle and ran the route for the quarterback. <laughs> I mean, he was there before the receiver, and as you said, there was nothing left to do but take it all the way back the other way. Elliott on now for the PAT. It's up and through. And the Eagles move out on top, 14 to nothing. Both teams ready to go once more as the kick's away. A return now from the four. Whoa. Good job in coverage. They're going to get him down short of the 20-yard line. The Commander's offense ready now for their second drive. They're staring at a two-touchdown deficit. 14-0 the score as the offense tries to regroup and get going with first and ten. They'll start on the ground with Barkley. Oh, he pumps up the football. And as you can see with that fumble, Mike, it really just goes back to the fundamentals of how they're taught to carry the ball. And they talk about the points of pressure. And the biggest thing, really, Mike, is you want the front tip of the ball, the part where your fingers cover, to always be higher than the back tip of the ball. So often you see that front tip go down, and it makes it so much easier for that defender to kind of rake it out. So you want pressure against the outside of the ball, both tips, the inside of the ball, and then keep that front point up. Back to throw here to begin the drop. They'll be forced to just throw that one away. It's incomplete. Nice example there, Mike, of the quarterback just being smart with the ball, understanding it didn't quite develop the way he had intended. Throw that ball out of harm's way. Hit to play another down. And he'll get this ahead. Game of about four. And it leads to third down. It's a game of four. Brings up third and six. They'll throw out of the gun. To the back of the end zone. He's got it. Touchdown, Philadelphia. And how about that? His first career catch also becomes his first career NFL touchdown. 
So the turnover turns into a quick touchdown. And Greg, that's exactly how you want your offense to take care of business. Anytime your defense can create those sudden change. And before the try, remember, it is a touchdown. All scoring plays are reviewed. So replay will confirm this one before we do anything else. touchdown originally they didn't find any reason to overturn it and it stays on the board the kick is good but there are penalty flags down they might have made contact with the kicker too late The kickoff team is out on the field and we're back to it as the kicks away this one is fielded in the end zone but he decides not to bring it out so they'll take over at the 30 yard line the commander's offense and running back Saquon Barkley heading back on the field a fresh set of downs to work with it is first down and 10 from the shotgun it's Daniel the open receiver is Dotson and that'll be set up now. Up past the 40 with Daniels now on first down. And they'll get him down after a gain of five, but that is enough for a first down. To the air again is Daniels. Throwing over the middle, this one is complete. And they'll take this down inside the 35. Inception out there, Mike, that in the NFL, you have to run the same amount of run plays as you do pass plays. Everyone talks about being balanced. But as you're seeing in this drive, you can fall on one side of that coin a little bit more as long as you're able to. So far, their passing game has dominated here early, and that last pickup leads to a first down. Off balance throw, it's complete. Nice job here by the defense. Did a good job just covering up everything for the most part. So once this ball was caught, really didn't have much of a choice but to just head out of bounds and pick up a modest game. Here's third and seven. From the shotgun on third down, Daniel. And they are in great shape. He's taken down inside the 10. First catch for him on this new season. And it results in a first down. Big time conversion there on third down. Finding yourself trailing at the moment. The last thing you want to do is waste this promising possession. Now, with that throw, they find themselves deep in their opponent's territory. They have to come away with the touchdown. And he's in. Luke McCaffrey. Touchdown, Washington. Well, that is a step in the right direction, finding the end zone. I don't know, Greg, could this be building some momentum for these guys, and that's important before halftime? Absolutely, and I think the biggest thing this coach is trying to get across right now on the sideline, Mike, is let's just cut into this lead and let's make it a one-score game at half. So they still got some work to do, but if they can go into halftime, regroup, catch their breath, just keep it close. Give yourself a fighting chance here out of the break. Both teams ready to go once more as the kick's away. This one taken at the seven. And he'll work this one past the 25 to right about the 28-yard line. The Eagles offense and the wideout getting set to go once more. The lead is a couple of touchdowns as this drive kicks off first and ten. 
Quick throw, taken in. And good yardage there after the catch. They'll wind up with a gain of seven on first down. Here's second and three to go. He'll drop to throw. That's over the middle and intercepted. Picked off by Jeremy Chin. I think he chalked this one up, Mike, to just a rookie mistake. And anytime you have a young signal caller behind center, They can get back into this quickly now. Very short field ahead. It is first and ten. Daniels now going to look to throw. A pass caught by Saquon. And this takes him into the red zone. He's brought down inside the 20-yard line. Set to go now on first and ten. Now Daniels. And he can't hang on through the contact. It's incomplete. What a good job defensively to meet him just as the ball was arriving. And it'll be second down. Here's Daniel. He's got it inside the five. And he'll take it on in. Ben Sinnott, touchdown commander. Greg, they take advantage of the good field position and move it downfield for the score. When you take the field as an offense, there's a little added confidence boost, Mike, when you see yourself this close to the end zone. You get into the huddle, you're anxious to see what the next couple plays are. You're able to take advantage and end up punching it in. Zerline's kick, up and good. And the Commanders draw closer here. It's 21 to 14. Still a little time. Final minute of this first half. We'll see if they can do anything with this kickoff that is coming their way. He's across the 20, taken down just shy of the 25. The Eagles offense going to take over here in the final minute of this first half. They lead by a touchdown as this drive begins with first and 10. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. He'll be forced to just throw that one away. It's incomplete. You can't fault the quarterback on this one, Mike. He really didn't even have much of an opportunity. By the time he hit the top of his drop and got his eyes downfield, the defense was all over him, and he really had no choice but to just get that ball out of his hand and live to play another snap. Well, he's brought down. That pass is going to pick up four and bring up third down. Back to throw. Now he'll air one out. That is knocked away downfield. Incomplete. He made sure not to let the receiver get behind him. Third down stop sets up fourth down. Here comes the Eagles punt team. As he'll come on to punt this one away. Fair catch made here. The drive will start at the 23-yard line. The commander's offense going to take over just before the half. They trail here by a touchdown as this drive will start with a first down. They'll throw with Daniel. Oh, no chance to get rid of that one. Under a heavy rush, he goes down. Pretty obvious this defense needed that play. The entire game from the jump, Mike, it just seems like the quarterback has been way too comfortable playing from the pocket. He's got himself two passing touchdowns here already. they got to continue to make him feel this pass rush. And he's going to be taken down as time runs out on this first half of play. All right, Michael, we'll get back to you and Greg in just a little bit. For now, plenty of early action in the 1 o'clock Eastern window to get you caught up on. So let's get to it. We'll start over in Texas at AT&T Stadium in Arlington. And as you see, they were winners back on Thursday night. Dak Prescott, a touchdown pass in the victory. 
From there, we head east to Tennessee to check on the Titans at home in Nashville. And you can see, currently, they trail in that ball game. Two touchdown passes there for Deshaun Watson. Lastly, let's get up to Buffalo to check on the Bills. As you can see, the score there in the second quarter. Keon Coleman, a touchdown catch in that first half. Both of these offenses had their share of high points in that first half. Each team had some big moments, and it would seem this could turn out to be a game where the last score wins. Coach, thank you. Both teams trying to find the right formula to come out on top in this second half. Coming up. Very good kickoff. Returnable from the four. And he's brought down right at the 25-yard line. The visitors' offense going to have a first crack at it as we begin this third quarter. They'll start it here with a first and ten. Throwing now, Daniel. He'll get this over the middle to Smith. And he's going to get this one out to the 43-yard line. 18 yards. What a great way to start the drive. It's a first down. And really the key to this play was just how fast he was able to get through his progressions. His mind was able to process and go from one to two to three so quickly that he was able to get the ball to the right target on time. And I think so often those two things are different. Being open is one thing. Being open and getting the ball on time, that's what leads to success. And that's what we saw here. Where a defender makes his tackles tells you a lot about his abilities. And for an interior defensive lineman, Mike, to make plays on the outside of the formation just speaks to his speed, his effort, his ability to run down the line. And we saw it here, and he takes the back down for a loss. And they'll get about eight out of that one, but still a little work to do now on third down. Throwing is Daniel. He's got a man. It's McClure. 14 on the pickup. First down, Washington. These curl routes. He's been running these routes since he was a young kid in Pop Warner football. And I like to call it pulling the string. You've got the defender thinking you're going downfield, and you stick that foot in the ground. Work back to in trouble. Down he goes. The offense goes from feeling really good about the previous play with a real nice pickup to then on the ensuing play ending up going the complete opposite direction. Really nice job here by the defense immediately getting back on track. What do the coaches say? Just play the next play. And that's exactly what they did. Work to do now as they come up on second and long. To throw is Daniel. But listen, you can't convince me, Mike, that there's a better option on the field, especially when you got a guy like this than on third down or critical moment. The size, the speed, the matchup problems that he creates. If I was in a critical situation, there is no doubt where I'm going with the ball. Back to the air one more time. Going down the center of the field, open man, and it's taken in. And he's in. Touchdown, Eagles. That football, yeah, that's a keep a touchdown. A terrific. He does it flawlessly. Look the ball in, secure the catch, and then get upfield and get yourself in the end zone. The kickoff team is out on the field, and we're back to it as the kicks away. Now return, coming from the seven. 
A good return as he takes it across the 30. The visitor's offense and Jaden Daniels ready to take over once more. And he has been a nightmare to scheme against throughout this one. This defense. First down. Washington first down. I'll run up the middle with Barkley. And look him up on the second down and eight. We are through three quarters here on NFL Kickoff Weekend. You're watching the NFL. Second down. Touchdown, Luke Washington. McCaffrey. Touchdown, Washington. That his second touchdown now here in the season opener. Greg, they are pecking away at this one now. Very big touchdown. Gets them right within reach of pulling this comeback off. Well, Mike, at the very least, they've given themselves a chance. But can they get a stop? Action here with Daniel. Oh, he's going to be bottled up and taken down. They got him. So they decide to put the ball in the air, which I don't mind on this two-point try, but the execution was just a little bit off, and it's not going to work out in their favor this time around. So, things a little more interesting. A one-score game. And it'll be brought down past the 25. Decent field position to start this drive. The Eagles offense back onto the field for their next possession. The advantage is eight. We'll see if they can make this a two-score game on this drive. First down. And he gets that forward for a gain of nine. Here comes the blitz as he looks to throw. No chance at all. He'll go. Up a fourth down. Here comes the Eagles punting. As they try to play the field position game here, protecting a fourth quarter lead. Oh, no fair catch, and he pays the price. Big shot to make sure this return didn't even get started. Here comes the Washington offense now. They get set to at the right time. So a combination of really good defense at times and at times really bad offense. Play action. Here's Daniels. That'll be taken in by Barker. And he's going to be out of bounds and just beyond the line of scrimmage. That's all they needed to pick up the first down. They'll stick to the ground. And now for a second time, he loses the football. And it's recovered by one of his teammates. Now, obviously, there's never a good time to fumble the ball. It's probably the thing that teams stress the most is ball security. But it makes it a little bit easier knowing that your own team was... They'll run here. And he's got nowhere to go. The defensive front controlling the line of scrimmage there. That is going to bring up fourth down. 
So often when it comes to safeties, Mike, we talk about their speed and their range. But for him to be able to come up and make a tackle and be physical at the point of attack and keep this ball carrier to no gain, that's pretty impressive. The tackle man at the 44 yard line is a gain of six. First down. So, two minutes to play here in the second half. Greg and I back. For Working out of the gun, it's Daniel. Sideline throw looked in by McLaurin. 15 yard pickup there. Good for a commander's first down. Offensively landing a lot of body blows on this drive, Mike. Just the ability to steadily march the ball downfield and remain so efficient, both run and pass. As they continue to wear this defense out, they have to find a way to end this drive with points. Anything short of that would be a bit of a letdown. To throw is Daniels on first and ten. This one is caught by Dotson. And good yardage there after the catch. They'll wind up with a gain of seven on first down. The entire time, secure rally tackle prevents that from turning into a big play. And a good effort there defensively. It's knocked away and incomplete. With McCaffrey, the intended receiver. And it's going to be third down. On play action, Daniels. Here's a shot toward the end zone. Terry McLaurin, the intended target on that one. And that'll set up fourth down. They'll try it now with Barkley. And he's not going to get there. The defense was ready for it. And they stuff him on fourth down. This is the drive that you have to find a way to extend if you're going to claw yourself back into this game. But the defense comes up with a huge stop, and that will all but end this game. The defense still with all three timeouts at their disposal as the quarterback's down to an E. Second and 11. Victory formation here as he's down to a knee. Fair catch called and taken right at the 30-yard line. So it's a win here for the Eagles. They move to 1-0 as they... Earn